Hey there, everyone. This is Aokao playing Fragile Dreams, uh, Feral Ruins of the Moon. And uh, we are in the White Room. Yeah, last time the video game went video game. We like had to dodge things that were looking for us and we had a little bit of like a, a, a quick run through a thing. I'm being very descriptive, I'm aware. All the things around me has a reflection, but Seto doesn't. Probably for technical reasons, not for plot reasons. Alright, this door has X's, and so I was like, this is it. This is where the girl's gonna be at. No touchy lightning. We got big blobs. All red. It's a good time. Alright, so there's like a sort of a MMI, RMI machine. I guess that's where she's gonna be. Oh, I wanted to read the floor label. I was not able to. These are not subtitles. So those are microphones slash uh, the, the other kind? Speakers? Hey. Language is truly an ineffectual means of communication. And as such, humanity's reliance on it will never grant them the evolution they desire is he that bored guy indeed humanity has digressed in the messages to an outdated organism then what's activating glass cage supposed to do what else it is a destructive force that will completely obliterate corporeal beings obliterate no why would you do it what would you possibly gain from something like that your petty verbal arguments are nothing more than a vintage relic. No explanation I can offer will make you understand my aim. So I'm not even going to Humans try. Humans are held down by too many chains. There's too much noise. It's a disorganized mess. <laughs> well, well, he has magic, so... Now is the advent of our era. Humanity's reign is over. Anyone, Anyone who, who threatens, threatens the, the project, project must be eliminated. eliminated. Wait, so we just... It's gonna be like a fight? Oh jeez, uh, okay. I mean, this is why I'm carrying a sword, I must add. So, here we go. Fancy sword. Alright, so we're fighting the head ghost. I don't know, he's like a wizard. He floats around, he threw magic. My katana did nothing. Um, what is this? Can I find angle with it? Doesn't look like it. Alright, so you just created these. And, uh, doesn't seem to matter all that much. Can I swing at these? I can hit them. Oh, but now he's on the floor and he was having a headache. That was probably when uh, he would have been vulnerable. Okay, alright. Got it. So he does that, he's like, whoa, check it out, I got magic beans. And he's like, oh no, I have magic headache. And I'm trying to get closer to get a hit in. But it's literally just too far. Okay, so hang out a little bit closer then. Understood. Yes, two full bars of hell, that's pretty good. Yeah, okay, you chug that one right at me. Alright, look, I'm gonna eat a ration, I guess. I might die! Uh, result right now, prognosis isn't looking too great, but we're learning. That's the important part. So yeah, here go there. I want you I want you far away enough that you do that, and I can hang out here and hit you like that. I removed a lot of health from you. Like proportionally Well, I mean just in pure sheer numbers, that is a lot. So yeah, how's that? I don't know, man. Okay. Oh, all right. All right. All right. I kind of okay. Good to know. I'm just exhausted. We both do a lot of damage to one another, and that is meaningful. 
Remember this? It feels like so long ago since we saw this scene. Alright, well, since now I know that we are fighting the last boss... Well, I don't know if it's the last boss, but it's definitely a boss. Let's go ahead and give ourselves a sword to start with. And also, I'm going to go load up on oxygen. I only have one? I thought I had more. Well, that gives me room for more rations. Alright, this is what my inventory looks like now. Uh, actually, I probably have a one... That is not what I'm gonna press. Doesn't look like it. Alright, so that's what my inventory is gonna look like. I'm going to resave, and yeah, like, if turns out this is not the last thing of the game, and that, ooh, whoop, I re, uh, well, I saved over my save, but it doesn't matter, because I didn't really progress since. But yeah, so, I'm full of healing, I'm going to use that technique to fight this boss, and yeah, like, if it's, if he has an important drop or something, I'll figure something out, it's fine. I am not too worried. Okay, I can press this button to skip. Good, awesome. Here we go. Yeah, there you are. Being vaguely dramatic. It's kind of pointing. And you got those sweet green tendrils everywhere. It's pretty good. Uh huh. Like, am I supposed to do something to get you going? Alright. Then these are released, and you get a headache, and I got a hit in, you got a hit in. Alright, great. Oh no, you're just gonna chuck it, you're not gonna have a headache. I'm playing with fire and seeing if I can, well, you know what, it doesn't really matter. Like, uh, uh, I don't think a ration's gonna heal me completely at this amount of uh, damage. Yeah, so, it's all good. Oh boy. Yeah, like... How do I hit you without getting hit myself, right? It's kind of like, what? Okay, you're doing something possibly new? No, you're just weak? That was just a chance for free damage that I didn't pick up on. Because I thought you were prepping something. <laughs> like, that is literally what happened. Okay, oh, jeez, really? No, I'm still alive, still alive, still alive, still alive. Uh, here we go. Doink, doink, doink. One more of these. Honestly, you can make an argument for the oxygen here. Like, I'm not going to let it fall further than that in the future, right? So, here we go. I'm not even full, so... Good call. I would love to get a hit in, but... Okay! Whoa, wait a second! Did I actually kill you? Okay, well I gotta level up. I didn't see that coming! I just melted through your health bar! What?! <laughs> okay! Like, we both do ridiculous proportions of damage to each other. I, I may have underestimated the boy's sheer resolve. And also the boy's sword's sharpness. <laughs> okay. Sure. We're doing that now. Oh, that was significantly smaller than to look like. <laughs> Well, if you can just teleport, like, what, what just happened? <laughs> like, okay. Alright. Okay, yeah, that is where girl is. Hand. Hand on a square. That worked. Good for you, because I wouldn't have thought of doing that. Not sure where your logic was. Maybe he just intuited it. Something buried in his memories. Uh, 
It's been a bit. Who's that? Is someone there? I can hear you breathing, you know. You okay? It's me. Who's there? Can't you mm. see me? I'm sorry. I can only see shadows. But it's okay. I'll get my sight back very soon. You touched me. Yeah. I touched you. We're still in the era where two models You're touching so each warm. other is a little bit weird. But I think they pull it off alright. Like, that's pretty well done. Who are you? Tell me. It's me, Seto. And my name is... I will never know. You are nameless. That's the backup system. It's finished copying her psyche to the AI. Even though she was removed? I guess said It looks like glass cage will still go live. I guess you put all the information into RAM before I could plug her and out. This time everyone will die. What do we do? I don't know about this backup system, but I think I know where Shin escaped to. We have to go there. It's our only hope. Let's hurry. Whoa, watch out. Are you okay? Buster Wolf. I can't help it. Every time I hear, are you okay in anything? I, yeah. I'm sorry. Okay. <laughs> All right, let's go. Hey, so she's actually here now? We are abruptly here. All right, have to find Shen. No going back now. What's my inventory looking like? Well, let's go talk to these. Game clearly goes up there. There's a box there I want to box. I didn't save. There. Bright light. That must be where Shin is. Like last boss phase two. Scary. You guys wait here. I'll go up. No, I'm coming with you. I'll be fine. Just stay put. I'll be back real soon. Do you promise? Okay. Sure, I promise. Listen, Sai. I have to do this alone. Sai goes away every time there's danger. For me. <laughs> well then, somebody sure has gotten used to ordering me around, huh? But I understand. You just don't want her to be alone while you're off. Uh, wait a second. What? Right there. You've got a scratch on your forehead. Here, I put thought... a bandage on it. Stay still. I was convinced you could not interact okay. with the physical world. Hmm. All right then. I see what you're doing though. For good luck. <laughs> I guess it's pretty weird for a ghost to be talking about good luck. Come back alive, okay? And Seto, whatever you do, stop him. Yeah, I will. I love how you have like gameplay elements like the firefly in the cutscene. No, 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 Seto. Tem temper your, your excitement. We got a mystery item here. I don't know what it's going to be. Beyond that though, I feel like the game is making a very clear case that we got ourselves a last boss up there of some kind. And, um... This is a really nice shot. Like, this whole scene here, this all looks really nice. I think I'm just gonna save and we're gonna go up there tomorrow. Next time. And possibly finish the game. Like, I... I don't know what, like, to expect. And it might be scary. It might be difficult. And I... I can't talk? Seto, can I, uh, you, I can talk. Shin. Yes, I'm going to do that. But you. Promise. Okay, there you go. Promise. Yeah, I got text out of you. Promise. All right. 
Okay, so, so part of me was kept wondering if getting to the girl would be like I half see. the game or the whole game, but it seems to be a sedative. Memory? Oh. Every day, time passes like normal. People wake up and go about their lives like normal. Night comes like normal. And everybody sleeps like normal. Things sure are normal. I can't do things like normal. Unless you're her. So, I guess that makes me a little oh, weird. A, yeah, sleeping problem is a huge problem for like a ton of people out there. And it is a legit problem. Sleep is important. I don't remember how I got to be like this. I'm not sure when it started. But one day, I finally realized that the nights seemed to last forever. At first, it didn't really bother me. It wasn't anything to worry about. But I think I'm losing my mind. The medicine the doctor gave me is starting to wear off. I had a friend some years ago who had like a lot of problems sleeping and it you know it it seeps into the rest of your life like you just can't really live if you can't sleep i finally understood what they meant when they said that trying too hard to sleep only ends up making it and, more difficult. and that's the thing like nailed it right so there after endless futile attempts i just gave up trying to sleep altogether but walking around town in the dark doesn't seem to be helping much either. Also, that's incredibly unsafe because like, you will crash at some point. You kind of want to be in a safe area when that ha A guitar! Yeah! Alright. Oh. oh. This used to be a popular makeout spot. Uh-huh. And even though there's no one to listen, that guy sitting there, as always, playing his guitar. Oh. Hey there. As long as there are people, there will be music. Oh, hello. Out on your nightly walk? I see you're here as usual, too. Yeah, guess so. So how are you holding up? Still can't sleep? If I could, I wouldn't be here, now would I? <laughs> Touché. Keep playing that song. Now this is a surprise. You've never said anything nice before. This is a really awkward conversation. What can I say? Your songs put me to sleep. Very, very shy man and a sleep-addled woman. <laughs> I'll take that as a compliment. Ah, uh, I'll have to hear him. I don't. I know it wouldn't have happened. Wow, just like yo, the whole. Oh, hey, now we got the guitarist. Well, this is a surprise. Or not? It's just their, it's their I story. I didn't expect to see you here. The complete story. Guess not even a worldwide calamity can shake you from your spot. <laughs> right back at you. Point taken. You want me to spare your ears tonight? Why? Because you don't want to sleep? No, actually. Put me to sleep. Interesting. And just why do you want that? I just... I just don't want my insomnia to make me the last person on Earth. Oh, this is post... End of the world, quote unquote. Interesting. Yeah, and pointing out how there's just that guy playing the guitar every day. Yeah. I see. Hmm. Hmm. It's just that my dad, my mom, all my friends, they all fell asleep and. Like, it's a very strange end of the world. Uh, some people are not affected, or some people are affected at different I times. Hey now, you already asleep? That doesn't take you a long catch time. Catch a cold out here. Here, borrow my jacket. I uh, don't feel like dozing off just yet. See? Now you don't have to worry about being the last one. Huh? I guess. She might have died. Chicken Man is in here one last time to pay us a visit. I'm just wondering if I have any other, like, decent healing I could bring. I recall the healing properties of the water was alright. Like, it's not, like, fantastic, but... And it's huge, too. But, like, if I'm not going to be doing anything else, like, I might as well load up. I like, might as well bring a tuna. Why not, you know? Delicious end of the game tuna. That's why we've been stacking our things. 
possibly. You know, maybe indeed, like, this fight is gonna start, I'm gonna have to pick up, like, a bow and arrow, and it's gonna be like, ah, 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 and I will go, ah, 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 ah. That's fine. That is something the me of tomorrow can deal with. So it does feel an awful lot like we're going to be beating the game here. I'm just gonna put an extra save here, because that's the state of yesterday with just things moving around. Beloved what? Beloved, I wish, Twilight Tower. That was a tower in red, wasn't it? How did we end up here? Well, we did walk forever underground, so I guess maybe that's why it had to be so long. It's for us to go from the dam to the red tower underground. It's a bit unsatisfying in terms of having a trek, but I could see that at least being something that could have happened.